All right, everyone. We're about to make some sea moss and palo santo soap. I'm just showing you my process this morning. We are doing hot process soap. We are putting the basin and adding the lye water. As you can see, lye really heats up the water. Now we're just pouring the uh, lye into the water. I'm sorry, into the oil base. This, as you know, oils and waters don't st stick together, so the lye brings them both together. Now we're going to blend these two components together and make them blend because otherwise they'll they won't blend properly so we're going to mix that and you can see it's already starting to change and mix together to form a soap called saponification process blend 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 Ooh, look at that watch this Look how creamy that is. So dreamy and creamy. The oil and water is not going to separate at this point. That's what we call emuls emulsion. Are you gelling? Look at those edges. This is the beginning of the next phase. This is how you know when your soap is about to be done. When it reaches this phase, the gel phase. The hot process soap is done that means the lie has cooked out and oh my isn't that beautiful wonderful soap now we're going to add some super fats once the lie has cooked out there's no chance in it eating up all the wonderful beneficial soap um i'm sorry oils that we add on top so your skin is just getting more moisture on top of what it already has some sea moss we're gonna add that sea moss has a lot of benefits for the skin as listed here more slow-mo because I really like that feature and playing around with that a little bit probably did too much but you know enjoy and we're adding the fragrance. This is the last step before we do molding. As you can see some of the benefits of Palo Santo listed there. So we're gonna add the fragrance to our soap. Mix it really, 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 really well. And there you go. We have made sea moss and Palo Santo soap this morning for you all. This is one of my favorite soaps because I know it's nourishing my skin. It, it's all good for the skin, um, but I love the scent and I love the fact that I'm using sea moss. It has so many benefits. So if you'd like to order, please do.